oh, looking at this person carefully, this is pointing our attention to the equations of motion under uniform acceleration. We have the car starting from rest, which means that initial velocity, initial velocity, which is u, is equal to zero. And it accelerates at this pace, four meter per second squared. That means acceleration. which is A, is equal to 4 meter per second squared. And we are giving time as well, 3 seconds. Time, T, we are giving as 3 seconds. And we are being asked, how far does it travel in these 3 seconds of a time? And the equation that will help us to address this is the equation that has distance in it. And in the three equations of motion under uniform acceleration, we have that v square is equal to u square plus 2as. This s is talking about displacement distance. And we also have that distance which, or displacement is equal to ut plus half a t squared. This is also talking about distance. But the question is asking us how far does it travel in three seconds? So, with the data available from the person, this equation will help us best in finding how far it travels in the three seconds. Because in this first equation, we don't have time, but the second one has time. So, let's go there. Let's put in the data that we have. Distance becomes initial velocity, which is zero, times time, which is three plus 1 over 2 times acceleration, which is A, 4, times T squared, which will now be 3 squared. So we're going to have this as to be equal to 0 times 3 is, of course, 0, plus 1 over 2 times 4 times 1 over 2 times 4. 2 here, 1, 2 here, 2. So we're going to have 2 times 9. So distance becomes 0 plus 2 times 9 is 18. We are going to have 0 plus 18 is 18. So the distance to move in 10 seconds is 18 meters. And that is our answer. Thank you.